Hey, everybody, paint talk. It's time. <laughs> it's 8.30 Central Time. Look at this 48 by 48 inch canvas behind me. Um, and I have been working on this one for the last couple of days, uh, but I have some more color that I want to be adding to it. Um, I'm going to adjust the camera. This looks excellent. Matthew, if you don't mind, babe, will you take this one and lower it a little bit down? This is Instagram over here, YouTube and Facebook. Lisa Dixon, how are you? I have missed you guys. I don't know where we've been. <coughs> where have we been somewhere? Lisa and Lee. Sunday. We just love surnames, honey. Lisa. Sunday. Hi, my Michelle. Uh, Michelle is back. So any is links, brushes, paints. Yeah, that's great, babe. Thank you. Anything that you need, she is here to help you with the links. Friday night. Did you hire we, somebody? Um, Michelle. Michelle. Oh, she's the new girl. That's right. That's yeah, right. she's real new. She's new. Um, so on the um, on Friday night, guys, we're going to come in early. We're going to come in 30 minutes early Friday night. We're going to have a live sell on the handbags because um, I want to be able to show them to you in person. Compare you, ask, answer all of your questions. And um, I am using, by the way, I'm using the new Flourished color from Bohemian Brights. And I've got my base on. I really want to add a lot of texture to this. Um, it's smooth and bold and bright, and I just, I want to add a little bit of texture. So I have my short stop brush from Paint Pixie, and I'm just kind of going to go in like this and bring in some texture. Uh, but just as a reminder, Paint Talk on Friday night will start early. And I also will have another guest coming on at 840. That's, that's good. Yes. Oh, my goodness. Trust me. Um, bringing on my one-on-one um, -on -one coaching mm -hmm. ladies and mm -hmm. part of their challenges to come on. And I know you've been missing it, Matt. You right. haven't been able right. to come on. Well, I mean, you can shut me out. Let's I didn't just, shut you out, baby. Let's just, just be honest here. Let's just let's address the uh, elephant in the room here. There's no honest. elephants in our room. It's a big all. one. It's I, a big I, elephant. I, there's not. You guys, like how Friday, are you? It's Friday so night, good to see like you, Shaz. Meredith, hi, Mom. It is a lot going on here, and I'm adding more to it. What were you whining about? I'm just saying every like Friday night comes up and, and I'm like ready to go. I'm in here waiting against the computer there. She's like, um, I don't Oh, need you're in here yeah. waiting. She's like, I don't right. need you tonight. And I'm like, what? What is what? And she's like, um, E D D and I was like, Oh. So me and Abby have to go in the living room and sit in silence. Sit in silence. Yep. Wah, wah, it's wah. true. It's true. Yeah, let's bring some of this glue down here. Hello, Shaz. Hello, everybody. I am using some of the new Bohemian Brights as well as some of the colors you've seen for a while now. And I want to just create some texture in this deep water. I'm afraid it's going to be one of those nights, honey. What do you mean? Because I... you were in here singing obnoxiously before we got started? I was just getting my... My vocal cords warmed up. They were, there was, I mean, he's, it's snowing. It's, guys, we're actually having our very first snow today. So he was singing, it's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. And um, it actually is. It's quite It's actually really beautiful outside. It's really pretty. But you know what tomorrow's going to look like. Hello, TJ, Papa Mac, and Irene, Sue. I am just adding some texture. I got my base on and I'm just going to keep going. Irene got her hat. Honey. Yes, she did. Thank you, Irene. I have been receiving some photos from this latest group of ladies who bought hats. Oh, have you really? Oh, man, it's just so sweet. So sweet. They're pretty cool. Yeah, it, it, it's a... Uh... I'm waiting for Dion to make me a hat. Well, you know, I actually thought about it. I, I bet you did. But I didn't think you would wear it. You kind of have your your own just really great style. <laughs> uh, it's this no. This is true. This uh -huh. is true. Yeah. So um, I'm using the new adored, uh, not adored chaos. This is flourish. I'm also using wandering heart. Okay, and then I'm also laying down some blue iris and some mermaid tail. Uh, the deep violet over here is actually acrylic, um, and I'm just bringing in a lot of texture now that I really have my base down. And who knows, we might be dripping water and color and doing all kinds of fun things soon. But I think that's a good idea. But first, I want to get all of this on here. Hello, Irma. 
Hi, Irma, no nickname. Uh, Derek said, uh, just uh, snowing in Ontario, mm -hmm. just saw a flash of lightning. Don't, you, don't usually see that when it's snowing. Wow. Yeah, I bet that's, that's a bit odd. We had a snowstorm, um, like a thunderstorm, snowstorm slash on the day after Christmas one year. Remember when it hit our house, babe? Which one? And it was like the lightning, lightning? The, the, when it hit our house. Yeah, that was fun. The day after Christmas, the boys lost their brand new PS4. Oh, yeah, that was a big deal. <laughs> My, what, are they staring at our TVs? And it yeah. wasn't much fun. <laughs> but we were all right. It's weird weather, weird weather, but we're just now getting our, our weird snow. It's kind of late, really, for us, but... Uh, Irene said she tried to send it to DR on Facebook, but it was blocked. It wouldn't come through. I tried to see the photo too, Irene, and it, it wouldn't come through to me. And I, I commented to you. I replied, but it still wouldn't come through. So um, maybe it'll maybe it'll come through overnight or something. Hello, Debbie Carter. Debbie Carter. It's kind of like, almost it's like. It's not like Carrie, it's honey. It's kind Debbie. Of, no, it's kind of like Carrie Carter, but it's Debbie Carter. Well, yeah, I mean. It's a difference of your name. I do see you guys over on Instagram. It's kind of far over across the room, um, but it looks like Delise is over there. Did you just start on this tonight? No, Delisa. <laughs> I've been working on this one a few days. Okay, hold on here. Meredith Lee. Hi, Meredith. Says they get thunder snow. Thunder snow. In North Carolina, pretty often. So this is a thing. This is a thing. Huh? Thunder snow. Wow. Not that I didn't believe Derek at all, because <laughs> he's yeah. actually quite the trustworthy guy. Absolutely. I just, I've never heard of it. Well, honey, I just said we had thunder snow on the day after Christmas. Remember? But it, w it wasn't snowing. Yeah, it was. It was an ice storm. It had snow it was and ice. ice and everything. It was ice. It was like, it was a, like 12 it was degrees a, and you had to get in the attic and fix everything. No, I just crawled up there to make sure nothing was on fire. Mm. Well, I just assumed you were saving our lives. My oh, hero, I was. My hero. Oh, I was. So what is everybody else up to, Matt? We're giving away paint, guys. I'm giving away some paint tonight because it just feels like the right thing to do. And I haven't given away paint in a while. So I have some green and kind of a creamy white from DIY. And I want to give it away to someone. So um hang on question over here i adore nicholas Rowe painting he was a great russian philosopher and artist your painting gives me a chance to see them alive the same colors and feelings oh thank you so much that is so nice how do you predict your pull in a winner we don't it's completely open we just run it it we, is completely we, open we don't cover it um we've got three waterfalls that keep it moving so it doesn't freeze and we got a heater on it Okay, Delisa says she wins, but you guys, we're going to give away two free jars of eight ounce paint. To so one person? Want to stick around? We're going to do that here in just a minute. Yep. Okay. One person gets two jars. I mean, is that what you're thinking too, Betty? Or I, hey, I'm. I'm just here for the free t-shirts. There aren't free t-shirts. You always say that, and I, I don't I'm, have t-shirts. I'm still waiting on my free t-shirt. Holy mercy, you're going to be here a while. Okay. So we're adding some texture. I worked over here. I'm going to keep working back over here. I really kind of love this color though. Um, so let me bring in one more color called Water Lily. And then I want to grab my brayer and start mixing in some colors. Guys, I'm going to do something tomorrow. It's going to be super brave. So I need some support and encouragement. Matthew. Yes. I'm going to go live on the Tiki Talks. No, you're not. I remember the first time I went live on YouTube. I remember the video. I remember the piece of furniture. And I literally stared at the camera and I said, please be nice to me or I won't be able to ever come back. I'm going to say something that you say constantly. Shut your face. Okay. <laughs> you are so dramatic. I don't say that all the time. I've said it maybe once in a week. One week. Not even funny. It is funny. I don't say shut your mouth. No face. Oh, shut your face. <laughs> <laughs> you, I've, I've heard that. Come out of your mouth a few times. Yeah, well, um, we got to think of a question first off, and I'm going to ship you guys some free paint. Um, DIY um, 
Lance even says yes, she does. Oh, you big bully. <laughs> Shut your face. Okay. So I'm going to go live on the Tiki Talks uh, tomorrow. So if you're not following me on TikTok, I am actually going to paint more on this painting tomorrow on TikTok. It's one of those things that I'm pushing myself to do things that are uncomfortable because that's what I teach and coach in all of my mentoring groups, uh, that that's where both growth happens, right? When you do things that are scary, you get yourself uncomfortable, not scary, like hurt myself scary, but like scary emotionally. And at the end of the day, you're good. You didn't die. And for me, it's helped build my confidence. And so people are tacky on YouTube. People are tacky on TikTok and I'm getting a thicker skin because of you guys you make it nice you make it really nice to be able to show up so I'm not going to be scared and I'm going to go test the waters on going live on Tiki Talks we're just going to give it a shot I have to be able to teach that's what I do for a living so I got to be able to teach show people how to do it what not to do that's a big part of it is what not to do right Ooh, we got some drips in here. Now I'm getting happy. Not that I wasn't. So how was your day today? So has anybody done a live on TikTok? Tell me now. Anybody watching done a live? Now? I, I have not done a live oh, on wow, TikTok. Oh, wow. Thank you, honey. But let me know if anybody else has. That's watching. If they say they have. Uh, Shaz? Is Shaz kind of there? Hi, Jazz, sweetheart. How are you? I think she goes live on Tiki Talk. Does she? I think. No, Matthew. Are you just saying that? Uh, well, Kristen Calhoun says Shaz kind of Shaz, you go. Shaz does? Well, Kristen. You go by the Tiki Talk question. I'm going to go look for that. What is your name then? Kristen, let's go live together tomorrow. Do you want to? She, she goes live with her dogs, but not painting. Oh, Shaz, I need to go follow you on TikTok. I... Derek says your painting is starting to look amazing. Oh, thank you, Derek. I felt like it looked pretty good before, but I just felt like it start, It was just, it just, I needed to personalize it. It was too generic. So uh, it's going to take me several days. <clears throat> Lisa Dixon would like to know what time you're going to go live on TikTok. That's an awesome question. And I have no idea. Um, let me think about this for a second, because I do have calls and coaching, and um, I have a podcast to record. I teach at 11.30 to 12.30. I would say 1 o'clock Central. Tomorrow? I would say 1 o'clock tomorrow? tomorrow Central Time. Okay, I'll be ready. You're going to help me? I'm going to probably dance. He's not. Kristen? If you're on here and you want to come on with me, thank you guys so much. Make it before I get the grandbaby girl if you want to go live together. When is that time, Kristen? I have to teach from 1130 to 1230 Central. Rohini, thank you. Let's get some, let's get some, let's get some uh, Dion style going in here. It's um, Jesse Massey, love it. It's beautiful. From England, Doncaster. From England, England. Doncaster. Thank you for being here with me. That is fantastic. We appreciate you. This is 48 by 48, and I started it on the floor a couple of days ago. Lance wants me to dance. Um, Lance can dance, and you can dance, and I'll I'll just um, how about I'll you? just get famous off of your dumb videos. How about you paint? <laughs> well, I thought that's what people did on TikTok was dance. Well, yeah. Okay. Sometimes, sometimes. Right. But I'm gonna actually paint. I'm gonna work on this painting. And if Kristen comes on here with me, then we can both paint. And we'll do it together live. I think I can have a duel. Kristen, can I, can I, I think I can bring somebody on like I can with Instagram. I have no idea. Oh my gosh. What if I can't? Dion is about 80% English. English. He's telling you my DNA, man. <laughs> Renee Smith, love this so much. Renee, how are you, my girl? Patient Smith, I painted a skirt for my paint display. Oh my gosh, you did? Patience, I want to see your skirt. I'll show you mine if you show me yours. Here's mine. 
Here's mine. We got to think of a question, babe. We want to give away free paint. I've got a great question. Here's Rohini says, your brother is hysterical. That joke video on your ring camera was over the top. He is something else. That's for sure. So I've never worn a tool skirt in my life, and I'm not saying that I'm going to wear this one. But what I am saying, I'm going to wear it in a video. And I used all my new colors with paint. And I did my dress, and I've got six skirts coming. I've got three of them done. Looky. I've got three skirts done, and I'm going to do three more. It's very flowy. Honey. It's so flowy. I haven't worn a tool skirt. I'm going to feel like the only thing you can do in a tool skirt like this is just smile and giggle. You just have to. Now, but if you were to dance in that, what kind of music would you like to dance to? Oh, man, you put that on, you could dance to anything. Anything? Oh, yeah, anything. Michael Jackson. Sure. Watch me moonwalk. What about Neil Young? I don't care. Who's that? Exactly. I'm kidding. I'm kidding, guys. Um, Elvis. Well, can you say somebody that... Merle Haggard. No, no, that's enough. You've gone too far. George Jones. You've gone too far. I bet they have a few songs that you could probably get. Okay, I'm putting this purple back in. We're going to get up here into the sky, but I may have to do that next time. I'm using this same brush for all of the colors. The new colors, the consistency is thinner. Rovini says, boy, George. <laughs> that was a blast from the past, sis. That's a good one, Rovini. What's boy George sing? Someone tell me. Really come on, 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 come it's the first thing that came to my head. I, I'm not real sure. Maybe Matt should wear the skirt, says my Michelle. Why do you do that kind of crap? Why are you giving my ideas? Ballroom dancing. Absolutely. I think you should sing somewhere over the rainbow in that skirt. <laughs> I need the snow to pass so I can go out. And um, I think the question is going to be, when you guys are ready, say ready in the comments. And then we're going to ask a question. And the first person to answer is going to get two jars of eight ounce paint for free. Are your beautiful skirts able to be washed after we get them dirty with all of that amazing dancing you're going to be doing? I don't know for sure. We should try that out. I just, I don't know about the washing part of them yet. Um, I'm really just trying to use the paint, you know, get used to it. Um, so I'm just not quite sure yet about washing it. So, um, yeah, I, I mean, it's a public service announcement um, at your own risk. We have a lot of people really, really excited about this question. Okay, well, I have, I have, like I said, I have, you know, I have three skirts. I have six, and people are asking to buy them, which I was kind of just planning on doing a fashion shoot with a bunch of girls lined up with all the, you know, and then I was like, you want to buy the skirts? So I like this idea because it's like, it made, they make me feel like a designer, right? You, well, you just have fun. You, it's just you, fun. You enjoy creating it's it. Just it's just fun. It's fun. It's like the yeah. purses and, uh, yeah, it just makes me feel fun. So, like, oh, I have a black one hanging right here. Okay, if you guys are ready, on your mark, whoever answers this question correctly. Now, Melissa, honey, you got to get over here. I can't see here and here is wearable art. Tessa, how are you, darling? I loved all the pictures. Thank you for being on here tonight with us. Yeah, the purses are the live sale at 8 o'clock Friday night. They will be live, and I'm going to show them to you. It's going to be like and an auction. Boom. Michelle will post the links, get them out of here, and um, then we'll go. We'll, we'll bring on our guest, Tammy, at 840. It'll be like an auction starting at 8, right? I am a designer. Thank you. We're, yes. We're going to start the bid. I'm not doing, like, the whole live sale app thing. I'm just going to hold them up. Oh, okay. Gotcha. I'm just going to hold them up. I mean, they're going to be live earlier that day, but whatever's left, we're going to auction. I mean, <laughs> auction. It's not an auction. Yeah, well, I want to be the auctioneer. No. Yes. No. Yes. No, they have yes. one price. Oh, okay. All right, fine. Oh, Renee, that's so much fun. Okay, everybody, on your mark. What, wait, what are we doing? For free paint. The question is, the first person to put in the comments the name oh, of our 1950 green Chevy Deluxe car, go. 
thought I was asking the question. You were too late and slow. I really don't think you're too busy singing. I really don't think you gave me a chance. Are you serious? I kept saying the question is Rohini won. No, no, wait, she didn't. Laura. Oh, oh, Uh, my brother. We had two of them right off the bat. Laura, Laura won. Laura Maldonado. Are you sure? Yeah. Are you sure? Laura. Go back up. Laura Maldonado. Do we have time stamps? Because... My brother said tater. Lisa Dixon had, and Sue are the same. Honey, they're way up above. She's go up on face to... Oh, uh, I'm on two different devices. No. Okay, so you got it. All right. It's Laura Maldonado. She won. It is Roxy. Roxy. It's right. Roxy. I had a great grandmother named Roxy Inez. Do you know that? Are you, are you, Roxy are you Inez, my great grandmother's name. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. Yep. Yep. So it is. Are you sure it's not Meryl? Well, Laura so, Maldonado got it on Facebook. So I don't get to ask my question? Yes. So that was you it, you right? have a question. You want to give away more paint? We can. Go for it. All right. Well, let me pick, there's out, more free paint let me over pick there. out the colors. Okay, there's some up there. But ask me first, because if you give away my favorite, we're going to be in trouble. Or any of these, okay? Yeah, those are fine. Okay. You can pick, I'm you giving away something. the colors that... Oh, black and gray. No. No. no black no. and gray. Okay, hurry, honey. Okay, here you go. These two. Can you not come around? No, I was just holding them. I mean... That's nice of you. <laughs> okay, he has picked out two colors, so... He wants to pick a question, so two winners tonight, okay? All right. So, a next question is, tell me when you get, wait, no. Laura Maldonado. they got to be ready. Hold on, hold on. Laura Maldonado. Deluni says, my colors. So, when you guys are all ready, put ready in the comments. Laura gets the green. Laura gets the green and the white. These are from DIY. These are eight ounces, so you get 16 ounces of free paint. And I, so this one, Matt has picked out a gray and an off-white. This is, this is going to be a little bit tougher question. Um, I did talk about this, and I have talked about this. What was and still is my favorite Christmas present I received when I was a kid? Go. What was I know. my favorite Christmas present? that I received when I was a kid. I've I've talked about this several times. One specifically on the podcast, we talked about it. Nope. What? Nope. 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 Soccer ball. Did Lance just seriously say soccer ball? Lance. (laughs) Nope. 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 Skates. Red Rider Beanie Gun, Lori Clark. That was a great one, but it's no. It's great, but no, that's no not cigar. It. That is not it. Uh, I told you this might be a little bit harder. You need to go bigger, guys. Go bigger. Matt was spoiled. I wasn't. <laughs> you laugh. It's this total spoiled gift. <laughs> it really is. It a really is gift. a spoiled gift. It really was. It, it really took me my time. I don't really know what happened there. A hula hoop, says a Deluni. Wow, she's. Oh wait, I don't know. That's not Delisa. I think that's Rob messing with you. Is that Rob? I could be Rob. All I'm right. Not sure, if that's Delisa or Rob. Oh, they, oh, they're they actually getting closer. Go big. They're getting closer. A tractor. That's not it. Have you ever driven a tractor? I have. You have? How old was I? She says I was too young. <laughs> <laughs> I was, uh, yeah. gosh, I'm trying to think how ten, old I was. 12, 10 or 11. 9 or how 10. How old was Zach? 9 or 10. A Harley says 10. Three Wheeler says, is that Rob? A car, a motorcycle, piano, a drum set, a pool table, dune buggy. Boy, that would have been fun. Yeah, we have it right there. Four Wheeler. Tessa Rapogel. Ah! Tessa won free paint. A four wheeler. <laughs> we talked about that in the podcast. I mean, that's Michelle's daughter in law. I know. Okay. I know. You talked about it in the podcast. Rohini, good, good guess. My, but that wasn't a Christmas present. But this, the Atari. Oh yeah, the Atari. That's good stuff. That was just Dad coming home with spoiling him again. Yeah. 
little spoiled brat. <laughs> Foosball table. Those are so good. <laughs> Michelle says, I'm so proud, Tessa. That is Michelle's daughter-in-law. Thank you, Tessa. You get free paint, sister. I did. I had so much fun on that four-wheeler. It was a little Yamaha 80. And it was funny. We were living my 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 mom and dad and my sister and me and my brother were living with my grandmother at the time. Why you're building a house? My, my my parents were building a home, and my my grandma's house wasn't the easiest. Um, really small um, hallways and real sharp turns, and they. They got it in. I don't know. I so don't know how they they got it in the house. taken the patio door off. I yeah. don't. Yeah, I don't know how they got it in the house, but they literally got put the four wheeler in the house next to the tree. And I, when I woke up, we we ran in there. We were so excited just to see what we got. And then there was this huge four wheeler in there, and I thought it, I thought it wasn't real. You thought it was like a toy. Wheel? I thought it was like a blow up or something. <laughs> Because my sister got a bunch of blow up furniture, <coughs> and uh, so I didn't even think it was real until I actually settled it. And then I got in a lot of trouble after that. So let's just let's just keep it that way. It was a quad bike. Though. That's all poor choices from a ten year old boy. Dangerous. Little right. Could have gotten into some trouble from that. Uh, no, for yeah, they're they're they can be if you don't ride them properly. And and did you? I did. I never got hurt. Good. Good job. So Laura Malcolm. Laura and Tessa. Oh, yes. Repaint. That's fun. All right, I'm gonna do a little bit different colors now. I need this to dry and I need to kind of walk away from it. So let me get into this area a little bit, go a little bit lighter. Um, I'm going to have to get a different brush. Now, I kind of want to get up into here, too, but um, I don't know. Is it looking like junk? Let me stand across the room. I mean, I don't, I don't, is it like, oh, I am? Oh, I like it so much better now before when I, than when I started. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, hello, Jasmine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is she a mama yet? Jasmine? Which one? Hi. Not yet. No, not yet. Okay. She's got a baby shower coming up, though. Not yet. I mean, yes, yeah, she is a mama. That's that, sorry. I shouldn't have said that. Yes, she is a mama already. <laughs> but the baby isn't born yet. Oh well, that's what I meant. I know, and that's what I meant too. But I'm like, yes, yes, actually, she is. <laughs> okay, look at this color here. I think this will be really beautiful. This is one of the mist tints from DIY, so don't ask me what name of the color is. It's like this creamy pink. Just so perfect. What was the favorite gift Matt got? It was a four-wheeler. Uh, Tessa Rapogel is passing the gift forward to the next winner. Oh, who was the next winner? You'll have to scroll back up, sweetie. Oh, Tessa is okay. passing it on, so we will scroll up um, and find out who... The next winner was. Oh my goodness! We'll we'll have, we'll go back afterwards. Thank you, Betty. That's the one I want, and the gray. You got it. Buffering. It's called a quad. Sometimes says Tom. Yeah, I guess it probably really depends on where you're at. Like where you are. Mm -hmm. Where you're located in the you know yeah. That makes sense too. Oh. Well, we always call them four wheelers down here. Three wheelers, four wheelers. Oh yeah. Okay. Two wheeler. Sure. You know. Okay, let's get some of this in here. Uh Joanne would like to wish Gavin a happy birthday if he's online today. What? Gavin's birthday today? Is Gavin's birthday? Is he twelve? Is he thirteen or fourteen? I think he's thirteen. Oh my gosh, it's Gav's birthday. He was commenting the other day. Um, look like watching the replays, but I haven't seen. Cheryl says, Dion, it looks like an awesome sky. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I think I want to add some more color to it, though. I... 
Oh, Joanne says it's tomorrow. It's tomorrow. Okay. All right. Do, does that mean we, he's 13, says Betty? Yeah. Yeah. I think we'll have to, um, next time he's on here, we're going to have to remember everybody that we, we have to see him together. That's right. We need to see him together. He may be sleeping right now. He's getting ready he's for bed. Well, getting sleep. ready for bed. We're all on a snow day. The rest of the country's snow days. Michelle says winner, winner, Sharon Keenan. Sharon Keenan. Matt, you're going to have to write that down. I won't remember. I am writing it down right now. Sharon Keenan, if you're still on here, you are, Tessa has gifted the paint to you. Um, so you need to email Dion at the Trip with Cyrus and let me get you that free paint, okay? And this paint that we're giving away is what? They call it the lab. They call right? it the lab. They're mist tints from DIY, but the paint, uh, the paint warehouse just kind of got the color off by accident. And so um, they're mist tints. They're actually pretty cool. Oh, I'm loving this color. It's a creamy. It's got like a touch of pink in it. Okay, now I want to get out Adored Chaos because it's like this deep magenta color. Okay. And I'm going to get my angled brush. And I am going to get this in there. Oh, uh, it's the same day as Betty's grandson. Oh. How old is your grandson? No, no. Wait a minute. Hold on. No, if it's Gavin's on the 13th, same as my grandson, whose B day is on the 19th. What? No, not real sure. Today is the second, right? Today is the second. Same age, same age. That's how she remembered the name. Uh, the age, same gotcha. age, gotcha. not date, same age. My bad. Well, I remember he was, I remember when he turned 12. I also remember when he turned 11. So Gab's been around a while. Such a great kid. We miss him, don't we? We do. I think we knew that was going to happen. Yeah. It's the way it goes. Uh, Cheryl says, I think you're painted today, Dion. What? You would be proud of me. I'm always proud of you, but I would love to see what you've done. So did you post it in the group? Or is it more private? Not quite ready. Maybe you did post it and I just didn't see it yet. Tom Grant says, Groundhog Day, Year of the Water Tiger. Year of the Water Tiger, okay. And it is Groundhog Day. And let me just tell you that he did not see his shadow. Right, Matt? The Groundhog did not Today see his shadow. Day? Yeah, it's February 2nd. It's always February 2nd. No, no, it is not. Groundhog Day is always February 2nd, honey. No way. You're just arguing to argue. Oh, no. Um... Oh, no, I'm pretty sure he did not. No, see his I know he did. Show today. It's snowing today. So what does that mean again? That means early spring. Early spring. We do not have six more weeks of winter. If he sees his shadow, we have six more weeks of winter. Am I right? That sounds correct. Let's say I am correct. Going back into the purple. Marianne Miller says six more weeks of winter. Six more weeks. Of work. So if he. No, I thought if he sees his shadow, we. Have okay. Six if months. he see, okay. Yeah. It, but we'll, I, we'll that's get what I thought. Oh, someone will correct me. Yeah, we'll get clarification. Off. I'm used to being corrected. Trust me. Yeah, Lisa Dixon, right? Yeah. Gavin is growing up on us. He is. I'm so excited to see what his future holds. Me too. I hope he still keeps in touch from time to time. Just want him to be able to keep painting. Well, if that's what he wants to do. Well, I know, but he's so talented. Isn't he going to be like a scientist? He's going to be. I thought he was a scientist a, or something. An astronaut or something. It was something awesome. Oh, no, it was a it was a doctor. I don't know. I don't remember. He's got so many options. Uh, 
Uh, Karen Brown, I read he saw his shadow, which equals six more weeks of winter. Oh, I thought it was where. Okay. All right. I thought. No, it, it's in, in pockets. It's, it's in pocket socket. <laughs> what did you say? Pocket socket. Pocket socket. Pocket socket. Yeah. <laughs> I can't say it now because you messed me up. Poxitani. No, no, I said it right. No. Yeah, yeah. Poxitani. Poxitani ton. Mm -hmm. That's right. That's how it is. Let's get some yellow. Spirited. Okay, Marianne Miller. On the Today Show, they said he saw his shadow that's and six more weeks of winter. Dang, Grandpa. Well, Mary L. Miller, I'm going to have to deal with Dion knowing that now. And it's going to be a rough six weeks. She doesn't like the winter, folks. I don't know if you know this or not. Damn it. Derek confirmed. Puxatani. Peel. Puckatawani Sonny. Yes, Puckatawani, honey. Yes, Puckatawani Sonny with Phil from Groundhog. Shaz says, we don't even have Groundhogs, so we choose spring. There you go, Shaz. I'm with you. Choose spring. Choose spring. Of course, it felt like spring. We were Sunday at a baseball fundraiser, and we were sweating, and people were in shorts. No joke. Sunday was hot. You're on the baseball field having a cornhole tournament fundraiser, which is why we weren't here Sunday because we Matt was working for 11 hours at the fundraiser, and we came home and we we're just tired and just needed to catch up on some things. So. Ladies and gentlemen, we have Tasha Watkins is in the house Tasha. today. Tasha, you guys, I have to make sure everybody is aware that issue seven submissions to the magazine are now open. You're all invited to submit your artwork, your cooking, your lifestyle, your any project that you've done that you want to create to feature in our magazine. Get after it. Michelle, grab that submission link if you can. Rainy Gardens and Rainy Day Vintage. Are you still using all new colors in this painting? No. I am in, I've also been using, well, okay, so I used the red and the purple and now the yellow. So I have for the last few minutes. Um, but I've also used blue iris, mint chip, and water lily. And then there was a little bit of mermaid tail over here. So I'm using all of them, Renee. This yellow this is the kind of the chartreuse color i'm just kind of lightly brushing it over adding more brush strokes tom says um the painting is lovely oh thank you so much mr tom appreciate you Betty says that's glorious, Dion. Oh, seriously? That's a big word. That's so nice. Thank you. I still don't feel like I've still got so much work to do on it, but it's making me feel like I'm going in the right direction. Lisa Dixon says, today is my brother's birthday. When we were kids, I always teased him that he was a groundhog. He would run off crying. <laughs> Lisa Dixon. I, I, would, I would not expect anything less from Lisa Dixon. I told him he was a groundhog. That's kind of like Holden's birthday is April Fool's Day, and we just, I never would let Elijah celebrate April Fool's Day. Because I don't like pranks, even though my brother is probably the number one prankster I've ever known in my entire life. And that's why I don't like it. Too many pranks my way. Okay. Barbara Stavis, this is stunning. Thank you, my friend. How are you? Happy anniversary. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Laura Barnes, it's birthday today, honey. Guess what we get to do? Whose is it? Is it Laura, Laura Barnes? Laura Barnes. She says, today is my birthday. I got called a groundhog a lot, too. <laughs> Laura, Matt's going to sing to you. Uh, I, I've been warming up the vocal cords, so. Well, everybody, I sure wish it'd be nice if I... I 
I like you to. You can't really hear everything. I know, but I like to imagine everybody is singing "Happy Birthday" along with us. Well, Wouldn't that be cool? I think they might be laughing with us. No, there's no doubt they're laughing, but maybe they're singing while they're laughing. Well, just imagine. It's that. possible. To it's do. possible, but. A lot of times people have people around them and they have their headphones in and they're not really actually saying anything. Yeah, but wouldn't that be cool? Like, I mean, if I come just walking through the house or sitting on the couch, like, with my earphones on and you're, like, in here and then I just bust out into happy birthday? <laughs> yes, that would. That would be It cool. would make me look at you weird. Are you ready? Yeah, let's go for it. Okay, right, so. Laura, you know, are you ready, Laura? We are singing to Laura Barnes. She is new to you furniture. She's been featured in the journal twice. She just released her own book, you guys. You can get Laura's book of poetry. We actually have it right here. I have it right over there. I bought it. She, she says she's ready. Okay. On your mark. <coughs> get set. It's not a race, honey. It's not a race. And a one, and a two, and a one, two, three, four. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday to you. To you. Happy birthday to Happy you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, dear Laura Barnes. Happy birthday to you. Yay. Yay. Laura, she's, she's 29. 29? Yeah. Woo. Sick. I remember those days. Do you? How old is he? Holden was born when I was 29. You were 28. So, yeah, Holden was one when you were 29, baby. That was so fun. He was such a good little boy. Wasn't it, Matthew? Hello. Say what? I said you were, he was one. Wasn't that such a good time with Holden? He was such a good little boy. Yes. Okay, he's not listening to anything. I guess someone's leaving a comment that's kind of grabbing his attention because he didn't hear a word I just said. All right, so I like the white in there a little bit. I think we're getting more flashes right <laughs> Laura Barchi says I wish I was 29 Tom says 29 question mark first time or again a question mark I actually um, don't know how old she is so I thought that was safe to go that route I I think she's older than 29 but I was just kind of being honoring Okay, let's get some pink. So I, this is passionate. This is the one I spilled on the floor the other day during my training in my Empowered by Design coaching group. We were doing painting for the whole month of February or January, and I spilled a huge pile. See that pile of paint right there, Matt? It stained the carpet? Yes, I do. That was me. You know, it's funny when somebody tries to be disrespectful. And they're trying to be kind about it. Isn't that funny? What do you mean? You know, it's, it's like a backhanded slap. They insult you. And then they say, but no disrespect. Oh. <laughs> no disrespect, but I'm fixing to disrespect you. Oh. What made you think of that? Oh, just people. People Did are funny. Someone said something on here? Yes. Oh, what'd they say? No, you, you want me to read it? They said it here on the line? Yeah. Oh. I'll read it if you want to. Not. Sure. This is for Mary Ann Shipman Hahn. Wait, I know her. I yeah. met Mary Ann. Yeah. She used to love you. Uh, she traveled all the way to San Diego to watch Yeah. Her. She's so wonderful. I love her. Yeah. She's fixing the backhand slap you here in a second. Uh, I shout that, and I'll shout that out. Now all canvas painting. It is Anissa Marie that started all of this. She is the one. Everyone copy her. Also, all the bright and young coats. Anissa did that. What happened to the furniture painting? No disrespect, but what happened? Ah, that is so funny. I don't know how long Anissa's been painting. 
but I started painting on canvas about six years ago. So um, I, that was before I even knew Anissa, but she is a fabulous artist. You're right. She is fabulous. She and if you've started. watched me recently, or any time you've heard me when I've had Anissa on the show, you're right. Anissa handed me the very first neon pink paint and said, one of these days I'm going to have my own neon. She gave me some as a gift. So you're right about that. She loves her pink neon and her neon colors. I don't know what you're the rest of what you're talking about, sweetie. Uh, but anyway, um, you you um, you missed following me from the beginning. But you can go ahead though um, and unfollow me if you want. But I do paint furniture. Um, I actually just posted one the other day. Um, I also have them in every issue of the Turquoise Irish Journal. Um, so I do just as much furniture as I do canvas. But anyway, sorry that you woke up on the bad side of the bed tonight. Mary Ann Shipman. <laughs> I'm just going to keep layering the red and the pink and the yellow because I still want it to like really pop out. And I got a long ways to go up there. But when I'm putting this chartreuse over the pink, it's giving that really warm tone. It's like to do that, and then I feel like I need the white. Barbara says hi from Texas, down close to the Gulf. Hey, what's the weather like down there? Is it cold there too? Did it make it down there at all? I don't know how far it made it into Texas this time. Well, I heard that northern, I mean, definitely northern Texas was going to get. Uh, maybe a possibility of freezing rain? I don't know. I know, I, I think it's going to swoop down. The, I don't know how far south it's going. Well, I heard Quita say that she was expecting to get some. Um, oh, she says it's very cold and maybe snow tomorrow. Down by the Gulf? Angela Angela McDonald says snow in um, Amarillo. Snow in Amarillo. Well, I think that's pretty normal. Like, Angela, you guys get snow, huh? Yeah, freezing rain in Texas. Hmm. Um, uh, Melissa Sanchez, I have trouble. Any questions? Oh, trying to read a question here. Melissa, Sa Melissa Sanchez, I have trouble get white as bright as I want it. Any tip? Any? Is there a tip? For which one? White. I have trouble getting white as bright as I want it. Do you mean on canvas or do you mean on furniture? Canvas, I actually do have have kind of a trick. Uh, Save the Life says it's raining cats and dogs between Dallas and Houston. Oh. She said canvas. Okay. So for me, actually, this color that's really bright right here is actually not white. It's mint. Um, I'm actually using a color called, it's, it's got a warm, it has like a yellow to it. It's called a mint chip from um, DIY. And it actually pops off brighter because it's got that yellow in it. Um, so that is kind of the color that I use on all my canvases for highlighting leaves and highlighting flowers. I use mint chip instead of white. Uh, Tom, what's that really white paint called? Not phthalo. Um, it's right. Titanium. Titanium white is actually um, an acrylic 
and that's the one that's the brightest. And I like to buy that in the huge jars. And there's gesso too, right? Yeah. But okay, it's, so a little bit, it's, like a, it's a different kind of product. Though. Okay. All right. It's like a foundation. Well, we worked on a lot of the canvas, but I still feel like I need a lot more. The strokes are a lot wider, uh, very broad, and I need more um, smaller strokes on the large canvas. So I think over here, I'm going to use more of the probably I'm going to get some of the unbridled love. Oh, look at this. See, this embroidered love is kind of like a, it's kind of an orchid color. That looks really good going over that deep red. And then I can dip it back into the Adored Chaos and get that red and just kind of overlap them like that a little bit. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, it's okay, Cheryl. I hope she leaves. No, don't apologize, Mary. And don't apologize. I remember you and your beautiful daughter. You sat right up here front next to me at the workshop. You were absolutely priceless. But I paint furniture all the time. If you go in my living room right now, you'd actually see seven pieces of furniture painted. So you actually are uninformed. So more, watch me more than once a year. So for now, you can unsubscribe and unfollow. Because it is totally disrespectful. I don't need you writing anything out, sweetie. You can go on and go. Ladies and gentlemen, we have Janae on tonight. Janae, I have been seeing you over on the grams. You've been busy over there. Has she been on the grams? Yeah. Has she really? You haven't shown me anything. Honey, you should get a gram. I don't even know what a gram is. <laughs> I, in, I in, when I was in junior high, we used to do like, like you could like send a gram or it was like a love gram on Valentine's Day to your girlfriend. You could buy it, you know, through the student co. You know, the student council. You can get like You're five dollars. So you get like five dollars, and you can send like a note with a piece of hard candy on it. Is that what we're talking about? Are we talking about the the uh, the wafers that you eat with marshmallows? Dude, candy grams, <laughs> the candy grams. <laughs> Do you know, honey, when we were in art class and I was a senior and you were a junior, it was Valentine's Day. And we were friends, you were dating somebody, and I remember asking you if you had bought her a gram, and inside I was just like this. I hope you didn't buy her a gram. Really? I remember it exactly. Yes, thank you, Tom. Graham crackers. Thank you, Tom. I Tom remember and I are it the same exactly. Page. Oh my gosh, I remember sitting there going, I hope you didn't get her a gram, and I was like, did you get her a gram? And I think you said, I didn't have any money. I probably didn't. <laughs> uh, you guys, I'm going to sign over on Instagram. Thanks for hanging out with me. I will see you guys soon. And I will talk to you guys later.
Thank you for being here with me. I will work more on this. I don't know if it's going to be during, um, I don't know. I don't know. But I know we're going to be back Friday at 8 o'clock Central Time um, for the live purse sale. Yeah. Do you and need then me for I need oh, you. Okay. You need I need you eight. and Michelle, please. Okay. Please, All right. please, please, please. Everybody, thank you. Uh, thank you for your continued love and support as I get on here three times a week, at least, painting my furniture and my artwork for you. You are so good to me. See ya. See ya.